the urban mobility situation is currently critical in Tunisia. In fact, over 30% of Tunisia uh, need to have their car to go to work. Uh, we had very great impact of congestion and traffic, uh, which represents 2% of GDP. Accidents represent 1.5% uh, of uh, national GDP and greenhouse gas emission and pollution 2 to 10 percent of uh, GDP. So to respond to all these difficulties, Tunisia has adopted a new national sustainable urban uh, mobility, which includes in particular a strong vision of the development of uh, carbon efficient uh, ecological modes of transport. And the main project we contribute to, to, to this urban mobility, new urban mobility policy are uh, the extension of line of metro, the second uh, phase of the, the high metro of Tunis, Arafer, and the metro of uh, Sfax and the metro of uh, Lag. Uh, the government of Tunisia has recently not approved the creation of the fund to finance urban mobility. The creation of this fund is a strong message and a positive message, and we hope that our uh, international financial and their technical partner contribute to uh, this uh, project and help Tunisia to uh, achieve all these objectives and aims both on uh, environmental and on climate change and social and economic levels.